Hello and welcome to 3400 South Dale Drive, Kettering, Ohio. Here we're out in the street walking up to the front of this home. First thing, this is located in a very desirable West Kettering neighborhood. As a matter of fact, not this house, but the house behind it is the historic governor's mansion where presidents have stayed and obviously governors have stayed. But this is kind of like a three-story house, two and a half stories, tri-level, bi-level, whatever you want to call it here, but it is definitely unique. Very little to no lawn work that needs done here. And the outside of the home was just freshly painted and it's very, very private in the backyard. Actually, I'm gonna walk you up the driveway here to give you a better view of that. And then once we cut off, we're gonna go check out that backyard. But as you see, very crisp paint on the outside nice deck on the front here and a huge deck on the back and a good size two-car garage and there's storage as well and the yard pretty much goes over to this tree line here and then we'll get a better look at the backyard once we go over there but nice stone retaining wall just a great great house and super unique i've never been in another home like this so let's go in the backyard and take a look here, so here's that left side of the house if we're looking at it from the driveway. So here's the backyard. The owners have not ever had any water problems in the basement on this house. You can see the outside's been freshly painted. They were gonna paint the deck, but the weather turned cold and couldn't get it painted at the time. But you can see this is a huge deck. Retaining wall that's still in very good shape. There is steps going up there to a little play area, which we're gonna check out because I haven't been up there and I'm just curious. This takes us into our breakfast room and our kitchen area over here. And coming down the steps, this is a little storage room right here. And it's kind of a two-tier deck. Steps down right here into another huge area. So plenty of entertaining area here. This would be definitely be the house to hold your holiday celebrations here. Do have a fence with a gate over on this side, build-in benches. And as you can see back here, very, very private. You could have a hot tub back here and just be naked as a jaybird, and I doubt anybody was ever gonna see you. Next, I'm gonna go up there and check out, there's a structure up here. I'm gonna go check it out just because I'm curious. All right, one thing I'm really glad that I climbed up here on this uh, platform that's at the back of the property. Amazing view. I don't know if the camera can really pick up all of that, but a great view all the way around. And that's the historic governor's mansion right there that you can see. Very, very private, very cool. This would be an awesome play fort for kids, or honestly, I'd hang out here as an adult. Okay, now let's go check out the inside. Very, very unique, very, very cool. Oh, and one thing on the way up here, walking up to this thing there's deer hoof prints all over in the yard right there so there are deer galore in this area you wouldn't think it but i've seen them all the time myself too you'll see deer back here all of the time okay next i'll meet you inside all right so here i just came through the front door we have a landing right here you can go down to the basement or you can come up here to the first floor and this is what i'm going to call the first floor right here where we're at immediately to our left Upon entering here, we have a good sized dining room here. All of this flooring is brand new in here. And these are all wood windows with the blinds built into the glass, which is very nice here. And very unique and very open. And we're gonna, you'll see what I'm talking about here in a minute. I'm just gonna finish off the left side of the house. We have a bedroom here. This is on the front left. So that would be the driveway over there. Obviously it's been turned into an office, but this is a bedroom here. Then we have a full bathroom number one, right off of this one. Good size vanity, plenty of room on either side of the sink. And you can see where this opens into the living room over here. And we're gonna hold that off. We're gonna go check out the kitchen right now. Good sized kitchen, plenty of countertop space. 
do have stainless steel appliances in here. KitchenAid, Samsung, Samsung, and Samsung. So all Samsung except for the dishwasher, which is a KitchenAid. Breakfast area here, and this is where we saw the sliding door that goes out to the backyard. And then, you know, living room, family room, whatever you want to call it. New flooring in here as well. This is where it starts getting really cool. Gas fireplace. And yes, I'd say that's uh, probably a 12 foot Christmas tree right there. And I uh, got a good another four feet if you wanted something bigger in here. And it walks right down into like a sunroom. This is all tiled floor. As you can see, we get tons of natural light in here, but there are blinds in those skylights here. All vaulted ceilings, different size windows. And I forget, I think I forgot to point this out. There is a door that goes out to the deck right here as well. But here you can really see the openness. We even have, they're not really windows, they're kind of just pass-throughs up here. Very, very cool. We even have some neat lights up there as well. And whether you call it living room, family room, wherever you want to call it, as you can see, this is a very, very open feel. You can see into this room, you can see into this room, you can see directly into the kitchen. And then from right here, you can see the open staircase that takes us to the second floor down to the lower level as well. So this is just a fantastic, very, very cool, as you can see, for entertaining for the holidays or just having friends over, this would be the place to have it. Next, I'll meet you upstairs. All right, so here I just came up to the second floor. Check out the view up here. Very, very cool. And they have the, the irregular shaped windows, which kind of gives the house a lot of character. And then this is really neat too. On the other side of this handrail, you can see directly down to the front door. So if you want to play a joke on somebody and uh, drop something on them, you could. That's my childness coming out. So. Owner suite here, this is on, we're on the second floor now. This is on the top left, so the window would overlook the front yard here. Ceiling fan in here, good size room, plenty of space to put a room, and we have a king size bed in here now. A double vanity, and there is our second full bathroom right here. It's got one of the energy efficient toilets in here, and then this is a big walk-in closet right here that runs the span so great owner's suite right here plenty of room you could have a couch in here if you really wanted to and then coming around the corner to get your bearings that's where we just came up so once you come up the stairs turn left you're at the the big bedroom for counting third full bathroom here plenty of room on either side shower tub um, here as well Let's see, this is gonna be bedroom number three. I may have them labeled differently, but this is the third bedroom that we've seen. And honestly, this is a huge bedroom as well. This is on the back left. So this window would overlook the backyard. And this looks like a standard size closet. It's actually pretty big. It goes, you can take a step into that closet for sure. Bedroom number four, we have double closets, double doors here and double doors there. Carpet here is brand new. We're one of the first people to walk on it. And that window there overlooks the backyard. So we have three bedrooms, two bathrooms up here. On the first floor that we've seen, we have one bedroom and one full bathroom. So we've seen four bedrooms, three full bathrooms, and a very, very cool area here. But we're not done. We still have the whole lower level to check out. Next, I'll meet you down there. All right, so here it just came down to the lower level. Immediately to our left, we have a huge closet, and this goes all the way underneath the stairs, so good place to store a lot of stuff. This is the door to our two-car garage right here, and then we have our what I'm counting as our fifth full bedroom, and this is a huge bedroom as well. So really, if we're keeping track, three of the bedrooms are just enormous in this home. This overlooks the front of the house right here, and then we have a big double bifold closet here. Looks like we have new flooring down here on the landing as well. And this used to be a billiards room. It's kind of a catch-all room right now for the current owners. But there's a plug right here where you can see where a billiards light could be hanging down above your table. And plenty of room. You can make this a theater room, ping pong, pool table, foosball, you know, whatever your heart desires. 
our panel box is over here and more storage and water heater is just a couple years old the furnace and the air conditioner are both 2021 and this is a high efficiency furnace so it should last you for years to come and if we're keeping track this is our fourth full bathroom so we have five true bedrooms four true bathrooms here and plenty of cabinets and folding area right here so that's our lower level here next i'll meet you back on the first floor for a few closing statements oh and this is not very old either this is all relatively uh, newly remodeled i'll meet you upstairs for a few closing statements all right guys so just a few closing statements here before i let you go very unique house i've never been in one anywhere close to this and i'm sure you watching this video would agree i mean look at that tree all lit up very very cool very nice house open floor plan newer mechanicals newer hot water heater newer furnace newer air conditioner open floor plan this has just something for everybody so if you have any questions about this home or if you'd like to see it in person feel free to give me a call or give your realtor a call i'm sure they'd be happy to show you this fine home and thanks for watching